This local sports report is presented by the Guelph Minor Football Association, proudly developing players in Guelph for community high school and youth sports football for over 25 years. Learn more about their tackle and flag programs by visiting guelphminorfootball.net. The U10 Guelph Griffins playing on home field on Saturday morning in Guelph. They would host the Brantford Bisons. First quarter, Bisons with the ball. Emery O'Connor for the Griffins with the sack takes out the Brantford QB. A couple downs later and it's the Griffins defense once again taking over. Harrison Wyke breaking through and connecting with a big hit on the Bisons QB. Then in the second quarter, it's the Griffins here on the handoff play. Harrison Wyke with the carry. He's charging downfield. Harrison checks his shoulder. A couple Bisons are trailing him, but he won't be caught as he runs in a 69-yard touchdown. And Guelph are off to a 6-0 lead. Then now 13-0 Griffins is the Bisons with a chance to answer here on the QB run. Thomas Geringer cutting through the middle and breaking a tackle. He finds space and legs in an answering touchdown, bringing the score to 13-6. Then it's the Bison's defense stepping up. Wesley Kemp with the fumble recovery turns over the ball for Brantford. On that possession, the Bison's pressing for a touchdown before the half. Jace Curry with the run. He stays in and charges down the middle. Harrison Wyke chases him down and makes the tackle. Final seconds of the half, the Bison's in scoring position, and it's Everett Inksetter Martin getting it over the line. The Bison's would add a two-pointer, and they take the 14-13 lead. In the second half, and it's Harrison Wyke again on the carry for the Griffins. He's good for the first down, and a couple plays later, it's Harrison again, this time on the fumble recovery. He finds a lane down the left wing, and he runs in the go-ahead touchdown for the Griffins. So they now lead 19-14, heading to the fourth quarter. In the fourth quarter, the Bison's on second and goal from the 12. Jace Curry finding a hole and charging through, getting Branford back on top. Then later in the quarter, it's Branford striking again here on the run from Steven Jackson. He's good for a 22-yard run, and he brings the score to 28-19 Bisons. The Brantford Bisons taking over in the fourth quarter on Griffins Field. Thomas Geringer cashing in another touchdown here on this run, and the Bisons are up to 34. Final minute of the game, Guelph looking for the silver lining here on the run. Eric Lachance fighting off multiple Bisons and keeping his feet moving. He's got the end zone in his sights. Charlie Sadler diving takes him down at the one-yard line. But the Griffins wouldn't be stopped here on the next play as Harrison Wyke finds a lane and brings it to the house. So a back and forth game in Guelph. But in the end, the Brantford Bisons taking over in the fourth quarter in this one as they win over the Guelph Griffins by a final score of 34 to 27. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.